Hello guys. Welcome back to another video. In this video, I will be talking about on why you should start using Blade of the Heap to see us on Clint and reasons why you should stop using these items on Clint. Blade of the Heap to see us cost 1950 gold. It's way cheaper compared to Scarlet Phantom and Thunderbelt. Blade of the Heap to see us gives 70 physical attack to 150 health and 15 penetration, which is good against tanky heroes. The Blade of the Heap to see us passive is called Ambush, and what it does is if no damage is dealt or taken from enemy heroes within 5 seconds, the next basic attack will deal extra physical damage and will slow the target by 40% for 1.5 seconds. In order to know when the passive is active, all you have to do is check your character if it's glowing red or see the heap to see us icon at the bottom. If you click the heap to see us icon, you will see how much extra damage you will deal. And if you didn't know you can buy physical attack items to increase your extra damage. When it comes to one-shotting people, the Heap to See Us build is superior. -like. This is one of the reasons why I replaced Hunter Strike with Berserker Fury. Clint passive can crit meaning. You can combine the Heap to See Us damage and critical strike in one passive shot, making it possible to one-shot people and also, it's a waste to not take advantage of his passive being able to do critical strikes. So the Berserker Fury has a 25% critical chance, meaning that's your percentage of one-shotting people, so no passive crit equals no one-shot. As you can see it doesn't one-shot anymore because of your passive not doing critical strikes. So you really have to rely on luck for that 25% critical chance. Legendary. Now, let's try critical build. If you noticed with Full critical. The damage is inconsistent. Here is an example. As you can see the damage is consistent with Heap to see as passive. And sometimes the damage goes higher because of the critical chance. Now, let's try Heap to see us build without the passive. As you can see the damage still stays the same on the three bots. Which is a good thing because the damage won't go any lower. Now, let's go with the Scarlet Phantom. As you can see the damage is not consistent compared to the heap to see us build and your damage will be incredibly low if you don't crit. To further add, your skill damage will also be weak since Scarlet Phantom only gives 30 physical attack while the blade of the heap to see us gives 70 physical attack and 15 penetration at the same time. And lastly, Clint is a skill caster. The attack speed gained from Scarlet Phantom is not really beneficial for him. I would rather get physical attack and penetration rather than attack speed, to be honest.
And for the Thunderbelt in my opinion, it wasn't as good as before. Nowadays slow is useless because of most heroes using sprint. And if you didn't know sprint can now cancel slow. I might make a video soon further explaining on why Thunderbelt is a bad item for Clint in my opinion. And that's all for the explanations for today. Now, let's move on to me going against a top global Benedetta in solo rank. Wait a minute! Your weapon and hands up. Gunslinger like me. You can't blame him for that. Just a lonely man on his way in the desert. Drop your weapon and hands up. What the folks do, visitor? Justice, sir!
Sir!
I've got a bullet with your name on it. You girls can resist a gunslinger like me. Drop your weapon and just get stirred. Just get stirred. Your weapon and hands up. I've got a bullet with your name on it. Just disturb. Bullet with your name on it. Sir! Sure. 